On July 17, 2011, Greenpeace activists and residents of Bengaluru staged a protest, vehemently opposing the decision of the Bruhat Bengaluru Mahanagara Palike, the Bangalore Municipal Corporation, to fell over 300 trees to facilitate a signal-free corridor on Sankey Road. Similar projects are being taken up at five other sites in the city. When I came here on the 1st of July 2011, I saw a lot of trees cutting down here around that stretch. I didn't know that when the massive trees, 150 year old trees are cut down, they look so ugly. I can't think that for the, in the sake of development, BBMP and the government is actually deciding to cut 300 trees down here. So what I'm saying is, if we do not think about our future, we do not think about the environment, how far is the development going to help us? Because development should be taken care of when you know you should you're not con supposed to concentrate on irrational ways of gaining profit it's supposed to be in the name of you know saving the environment and saving something good so i don't think so if you know they decide to cut down 300 trees here is going to be a right decision despite sustained public outcry and the demand for a larger public consultation the civic body, in a gross violation of the Karnataka Town and Country Planning Act, as well as orders from the Karnataka High Court, has already, without following due procedure, allowed contractors to cut several trees illegally at night. Activists are questioning the need for such a project in the wake of bigger problems of drainage and housing, for which the state government claims that there is a lack of funds. There has been no social impact assessment of signal-free corridors that render the road unusable for pedestrians and cyclists. It is also ironic that trees inside Aranya Bhavan, the forest department office, have also been permitted to be cut. The mayor had assured that only 19 trees will be cut when the project was first announced. During the protest, when faced by local residents and activists, the mayor and the deputy mayor refused to comment claiming that the issue is subjudice. In a bid to save the trees, two Greenpeace activists climbed up a tree and stayed there for 24 hours. It's been almost 22 hours now since we've been sitting on this tree. This is one of the 300 trees that has been uh, uh, identified by BBMP to be axed for road widening. Uh, BBMP says that these trees are being axed because the residents want wider road. The government, central government has identified hundreds of acres of uh, forest land to be mined for coal because again they are saying that because people want electricity and I could not take it anymore as a resident of Bangalore where, where in my name the government is going ahead and destroying trees saying that I want wider roads. No, I do not want wider roads. The reason why I am up here because to gather support from fellow residents of Bangalore and uh, now in a few hours there will be a, uh, the public interest litigation is supposed to be heard in the court. Uh, in less than 24 hours time, we've got more than 3,000 Bangaloreans who've come forward to support this cause. Uh, around 3 p.m., we are going to go with all that support to the mayor and ask the mayor why has she kept quiet. She, it's her responsibility to take care of the city and to make sure that even before any single tree faces the axe, local residents should be consulted and there should be a public consultation before um, uh, any tree uh, faces the axe. And that's what we are here for. Uh, I want to thank all the fellow Bangaloreans who have supported us through Facebook, Twitter uh, for our cause. Uh, and I would want more and more people to come forward and start joining this cause because uh, it's, it's not just a bunch of people. We need more and more people to come forward so that we can put uh, pressure on the right targets and then save uh, the garden city and make it like it was before. The peaceful protest was joined by noted actor and singer Vasundhara Das. The protest was rewarded with a court order compelling the Bangalore Municipal Corporation to conduct a statutory public consultation on the issue.